Well, guys, have you ever wondered why, for every different tRNA that we have, excuse the bad drawing, you have a different amino acid up here? Got our CCAENT here. You've got three bases here. How come, depending on those three bases, we have a different amino acid? Because it's all tightly locked down. Well, it's all about an enzyme. The enzyme fits our tRNA including this piece and it fits the amino acid at the top. Now depending on the three bases we have in the anticodon changes the shape of our tRNA so a different enzyme is used. So the shape here causes the right enzyme to fit because of the active site here when the right enzyme will only attach the correct amino acid here. So the whole thing about getting the right amino acid at the top to match the anticodon at the bottom is about the shape of the bottom here, meaning the right tRNA activating enzyme fits the whole thing. Big long word. Doesn't make much sense when you look at the picture like this. But when you realize the T is not really the real shape of it, if you have a look here, you know, we look at the cloverleaf model, we say it's a T shape, it's easy. But in the real world, the whole thing is a complex shape like this. And so the shape of this affects the shape of the whole molecule, which affects the enzyme, which will then put the amino acid on.